Hey guys, I'm back. I told you I'd be back, didn't I? And yay, I actually am this time. And I actually would have been back last week, except I ended up in the hospital again. Yay for me. <laughs> anyway, I am finally feeling uh, better today, which is great. Still not back to my old self again, but getting there. Uh, it just seems like every time I get better, then some crap happens and I end up back in the hospital again, worse than before. Uh, anyway, I figured while I'm actually feeling like I'm not dead, <laughs> why don't we get a haul done? Uh, you guys, this is just a sneak peek of what's going to be in one of my next hauls. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so excited. I've got art hauls coming up that I'm just so excited to share with you guys. Uh, but yeah. I wanted to have those out there just because my videos keep getting flagged and the comments keep getting taken away. I kept saying that before. So just wanted to apologize in advance for this ugly, white, boring background. Not ugly, sorry. Don't want to insult anyone else that has a plain background. It's just not my style. Okay, guys. So today, as you guys can see from the title, we have a valentine's haul and it's actually pretty small compared to like most hauls that i've done on my channel but yeah we're just gonna go with it oh too much shadow over there okay i will move this back over here sorry about that guys whoopsie now we got stuff falling all over the place okay so first things first we have these really cute little heart uh cabochons or charms, whatever you'd like to call them. Also, you guys, I'm sorry because of the fact that I'm trying to block out my background so my video doesn't get flagged and the comments don't get removed. Because of that, uh, it's probably going to take me a few videos to figure out like a proper new setup. So for now, if things are like a little bit blurry sometimes, uh, hopefully, or like out of focus, hopefully it's not too much. It doesn't bother you guys too much. But anyway, I'm going to stop rambling and let's get into the video. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Give this video a big thumbs up because it really helps the channel. And yeah, let's jump in. Uh, also, everything that I'm going to show you guys here today is from AliExpress. And uh, some of it is new stuff, new for 2022 and 2023. And then some of it is stuff that uh, has been available in the past. So yeah, but there is a bunch of new stuff, which I'm really excited about. And okay, I'm going to stop rambling now. So anyway, first things first, I got these really cute little heart cabochons or charms. Again, whatever you like to call them. They are flat back, uh, so they can be used for multiple purposes they are super pastel and they are like little heart-shaped macarons super super cute and i ended up finally finding out a couple years ago that there is a big difference between macarons and macaroons like when i was little i had never heard of macarons so i always assumed that everyone was just pronouncing them wrong but no they're actually two completely different desserts uh, my mother used to love macaroons when i was little Anyway, so those are the heart-shaped macarons. Next, we've got these really cute little Be Mine. Oh yeah, I'm definitely going to have to think up a new setup here, you guys. So sorry for the bad visuals, but these are super, super cute. Be Mine, and they are like kind of translucent and sparkly. So they are definitely different from the ones that we've been having, the Conversation Heart uh, cabochon charms that have been out the last few years. Uh, so yeah, those are super cute. And I think these come with 20 in a bag. No, I think these actually come with 30 in a bag. And most of this stuff is actually all from the same seller. I, I did like a $500 haul from this seller, but it's not all going to be in this video. It's all split up into different hauls. I've got like an Easter haul coming and a mermaid haul. God, hopefully just saying those words, watch just saying those words, get this video freaking flagged, like so retarded. Um, anyway, next we have, these are not conversation hearts, but they are still Valentine's Day themed. It's like a little... What would you call that? A thought bubble? A speech? A speech bubble, I think you'd call it. And they just say the word love. They are all glitterly. Glitterly. <laughs> yes, they are literally glitterly. Uh, anyway, they are like 
translucent on the front, like clear on the front, but then they've got the opaque resin on the back, which makes like a really cool look to them. And I think these come with 20 in a bag, if I'm not mistaken, although it, it might be 30, you guys. Uh, I think these are 20 though. Super, super cute. Next, we've got some of these, some of these, uh, oh my gosh, you guys, my brain ain't even working today. What the heck? I haven't made a video in so long. Next, we have some of these sprinkles. And for some reason, like I actually cut off camera for a second because I don't know why the bag has like all this dusty looking I don't want to call it dirt, but like there's like debris in it and I'm not quite sure why. Oh, there's a little smiley face that doesn't belong there. And I checked, it's not glitter. Uh, I I don't know what what that is, you guys. Um, but anyway, we won't focus on that. Um, this is a really gorgeous mix. I actually love this mix so much for Valentine's Day. Like I am obsessed with these little round pieces so these are definitely super cute for any kind of crafting shaker mixes uh, i even use this stuff on my nails now you guys i know it's weird i've got one hand done i put a peel off base coat on this hand and some top coat i'm actually going to be doing something really funky with my nails so hopefully i'll have that done for the next video uh, but yeah whatever you guys are into of course a lot of you who are subscribed to me know uh, i have a shop on etsy so you probably know what i'm going to use these for but i'm not going to say it because once again, I don't want the video to get flagged by these damn YouTube bastards. Uh, also, it doesn't even matter. Even if I curse in my video, they will still flag it and remove the comments. Like, how, how does that even make sense? Uh, so anyway, we have these other ones right here. And these would also be good for Christmas as well. Ooh, we've got a random leaf in here. And uh, does this bag have debris? No, this bag does not have any debris. Thank the good Lord in heaven. Will that get me flagged? Hopefully not. Or thank the goddess, whatever, whatever, whoever you want to thank. They are super, super cute. They are like the pinwheel design. So they are similar to these ones here, except they are just plain uh, red and white. Super, super cute. So next we have more females. I think this is supposed to be Kirby. That's why I bought them anyway. I think it's Kirby, but like a heart shape. So definitely could be used for Valentine's too. This one is a hundred grand bag. This one was also a hundred grand bag, or it might've been actually a 65 grand bag. And I split it with a friend, uh, me and a friend who also has a shop on Etsy. We made like uh, an order on AliExpress where we split everything in the order well, most things, some things I got, some things she got, and then other things we split just to save money. So this was one of the things we split. That's why the bag is not full. Uh, but yeah, I got these Kirby's little Kirby heads and I think they are so adorable. And then next I got these and they're like little envelopes. These would even be great for like happy mail, I think to make a little happy mail shaker. Cause you know, it's got the envelope and the heart or anything, but again, perfect, perfect for Valentine's day. You guys, I am so sorry about this lighting. Oh my gosh, this is terrible. Um, can we do anything about that? I, I don't know. I'm so sorry, you guys. It, it was better before. Oh my goodness. Okay. Um, so here we have more. I absolutely love these. There's actually a bunch of charms that just came out in this like style. And wait till you guys see some of my next few hauls coming out. Like, they are so cute, the charms in this style. So these are just uh, love hearts, as they say in Australia. I don't know if you guys say that in the in the UK too. In Canada and like even in the US, I think we don't call them love hearts. We just call them hearts. Um, <laughs> I guess you guys call them love hearts. So they're not to be confused with like the body organ called a heart. But yeah, I I had never heard that before youtube and watching hauls so yeah these are just little love hearts and they are extremely pastel extremely cute so gotta love those uh then i got these and when i got these these were fairly new like before you could only get this matte glitter if you bought like 500 dollars worth or like 150 dollars worth it was only available in like large large amounts but now they have started selling it on aliexpress 
in smaller amounts before it was only on Alibaba. And also, of course, you could get it on Etsy in like tiny quantities from people who were like buying it on Alibaba and reselling it for like nail purposes and things like that. But now you can get it on AliExpress. This was new when I bought it. Honestly, you guys, you know, I haven't been posting in so long. I have had some of this stuff like this uh sitting here for like over a year the rest of this stuff is all very new i got it very recently but i will let you know anything that i got that isn't uh, a recent purchase but yeah you guys so these are matte hearts and they're like hollowed out in the middle so you also get the little cutout pieces there super super cute gotta love those then I got more conversation hearts and these are like the type that was available last year and the year before. I don't know if you guys remember um, when I hauled a bunch of these. There is like five different styles, at least five different styles of these hearts. I actually have another bag of them over here, but the bag broke and I think, yeah, these are exactly the same. This is actually the first time that I've had them come with that yellow color like that never had that before but as you guys can see they are super super pastel so i definitely love those i have bought a bag of 50 of these conversation hearts in the past and i actually only have about 10 left or something that i've used like crazy for my crafting so then we have these which are super super valentine's day uh esque <laughs> I don't know what I'm even saying, you guys. Uh, but yeah, I you can get them in either red, light pink, or like middle pink. I don't want to call it dark pink because it's, it's almost like a bubblegum pink. Uh, anyway, yeah, you can buy them in any of the three colors or you can get them in a mixed bag. And I chose the mixed bag. This is, again, another purchase that I'm going to be using for my Etsy shop. These are here and I don't think I showed these to you guys yet. Uh, but I did get two bags of these. I thought these were absolutely adorable. This is an item that I did get a couple months ago. Uh, and when I saw it, I definitely had never seen it before. So this definitely came out in the last year, possibly even in the last six months. Super, super cute, super, super glittery. Absolutely love that. Again, we've got like the clear or translucent resin with the opaque resin at the back and i just love the effect that that gives and they are super pastel and super glittery you guys absolutely love those and actually um i was just looking at youtube the other day i didn't watch any of the videos but i was just like scrolling through videos and thumbnails and i actually saw these in a thumbnail of uh, my friend cutesy shelf so i don't know if you guys are subbed to her but if you like my videos and stuff like this um then you should definitely check out her channel if i remember i'll link it below or she might even comment below hi diem uh she's one of the people that i kept in touch with since i stopped posting not so much in the last few months i really haven't been well but anyway she is definitely a very very sweet person uh so then i also got these and these are super super cute again more valentine's day to oh does one have a broken wing one has a broken wing, but you know, that can definitely still be used, especially for deco den. Like you can stick the broken side into the deco whip and then like nobody even knows that it's broken and it still works fine. So there's definitely still uses for broken things. Or if you wanted, you could just break the other wing off and have it be an envelope. But yeah, love, love these. I think these are so super cute and perfect for Valentine's Day. So then next I got these bear charms and these ones are actual charms with the eye screw why are my hands looking so dirty on camera like i mean just dark like they have like a weird almost like an ink stained look i guess it's the lighting i don't know it's just bugging me i just tried to make it go away but i couldn't anyway these are little bears and they say friends and obviously they could be used for any time of year but they kind of reminded me of valentine's day because you know people give each other stuffed bears for valentine's and stuff like that so i thought those were super cute and i figured i'd put them in the valentine's haul again they are super super pastel and the brown one could be reminiscent of like a chocolate bear so i thought that was cute also for some of these items you can actually ask the seller 
um, like for a mix like this, if there's a color you didn't want, like say you didn't want uh, this color here or you didn't want the yellow, you could message the seller and say, excuse me, can I get, uh, I want to buy this, but I don't want the yellow ones or I don't want the peach ones. And most sellers, like 80% of sellers will be cool with that. And they'll be like, okay, sure. Just leave a note at purchase. And usually it works out just fine. So that's also a tip. Um, and then these, oh my gosh, you guys, I love these so much. Now this is another item that I have had sitting here for somewhere between three and six months. Um, but this definitely was not around like five years ago, three years ago. So this is definitely an item that came out in the last like year, maybe two years max. Um, but as you guys know, I definitely used to haul uh, different, actually, maybe I can just grab one over here to show you guys. Sorry about that guys. So these are some, uh, like an example of a style that I used to haul. I turned these ones into earrings as you guys can see and i actually love these earrings they are definitely big but they definitely suit my style they're not ones that i wear every day i even have a mini pair but i do wear them i have worn these like so much and i have them in every color i've actually worn them so much that i need to make a few more pairs because i've actually lost a few of them and one thing i love about them is that you can wear them with like one blue and one purple or one pink and one purple um, and they're also amazing for keychains they make the cutest flipping keychains you guys so anyway uh this style came out like what four or five years ago at least and i freaked out yeah i think it was about four years ago they weren't out yet in 2017 or 2018 i know that i they might have come out in like 2019 i think that's when they came out uh but anyway yeah so these are newer ones and they are so so cute you guys they have glitter in them so the ones that uh came out like when those ones came out they did have clear ones too but they did not have glitter these ones have glitter and just the translucency of them is so adorable the eye screw on these ones is gold which is cool too because most things well a lot of things anyway come with a silver eye screw so it's always nice to have the gold option because i do prefer to match my findings to whatever the eye screw is or whatever color the hook is i definitely like to match my findings i know some people don't mind but I am just picky about things like that. A perfectionist or OCD, whatever you want to call it. Um, so then next up, we have more flat back charms, cabochons. And again, I thought these ones were totally Valentine's Day related. I honestly kind of wish that I had got the mixed pack for these, you guys, because they do have a mixed colored pack. But I did get the purple. Again, I got these for my Etsy shop for my creations that I make. And I think these are gonna be absolutely perfect for Valentine's Day. So I did pick those up as well. Again, translucent with the glitter, absolutely love that. So next I picked up a bag of these hearts and this is a repurchase, but I honestly don't think that I showed the original ones that I bought to you guys. Most things that I've bought in the last two years, I haven't actually shown you guys like i have so so much that i haven't shown you guys that's like one of the reasons one of the big reasons that i have to start making videos again other than the fact that i miss you guys so much um is because like the youtuber in me won't allow me to put things away unless i've shown them to you guys so i have like <gasps> mounds of stuff i have like a whole room just dedicated to stuff that i need to show on youtube um, and honestly, for a while, like at the beginning of it all, when I stopped posting, uh, I did start my friends were like, are you crazy? Just open this stuff and use it. Cause I was like, ah, I have all this stuff that I want to use, but I can't use it cause I haven't shown it in videos yet. And people were giving me the advice of, are you crazy? Just use it. So there was a period in time, like about two years ago, even a year and a half ago, where I was even a year ago where I was opening stuff and less than a year ago where I was opening stuff and using it like and not showing it to you guys and honestly that made me more depressed and more sad than just having it here in boxes not using it waiting to show it to you guys like you don't know how much it hurt me to open this stuff and use it when I hadn't shown it to you guys yet. It was terrible. So I finally realized that and I was like, okay, screw that. If I keep doing that and keep using this stuff, then I'm just never going to make the videos because like wanting to use it 
is one of the things that had me make the videos, you know, because I couldn't use it until I made the video. So it was like kind of, you know, pushing me to make the video. Anyway, uh, so yeah, these are just the hearts, the red hearts, clay hearts. And uh, this seller uh, has pretty good prices for them too. And it's a hundred grams and I have hearts in every single color. They're gonna be in another clay sprinkle haul that I'm gonna show you guys. So I also got these M&M charms. I'm not sure why I have them in this video. These are actually, I must have thrown these in the wrong thing. These are supposed to be in the food themed haul. Uh, but anyway, yeah, you guys, these are M&M charms and they're super cute. And oh my gosh, I feel like the light is like getting even worse. Oh yeah, it's gotten dark outside. No wonder. Uh, but yeah, those are M&M charms. I already have these in a whole bunch of pastel colors uh but the purple ones that i got last time were not good quality these ones actually are you have to be careful you have to look really really closely at the pictures when you buy these and even then some sellers will like lie and put pictures of other ones these ones are all stamped really really good and uh, none of the markings are messed up none of the paint is missing there's no scratches or anything like that so i'm super happy and i'll probably end up ordering some pink ones from this seller as well uh, i got the mix pack just to use for random uh items in my shop uh because i think they might go good with different food themed projects that i make uh, so I did grab those and next I got these bears and I think that these bears were in the same listing as these hearts so I might end up using these together and again there's an option to get either the pink ones or the brown ones and I did end up choosing the mixed ones so here's a little look at them out of the bag and again you guys i'm so sorry for the lighting my actual uh big lighting thing what's it called why was i gonna call it a tripod my filming lights are actually downstairs right now because i use them for pictures for my shop but it's looking like i'm gonna have to bring them up again i've also ordered like a heart-shaped ring light that clips onto my desk so once that arrives hopefully that'll make a difference and that is supposed to be arriving next week uh okay so we also got some glitter you guys now just a heads up i am also going to be showing this glitter in a glitter haul that i have coming up i got like a whole ton of glitter from this store if you guys are interested please remind me because there's just way too much stuff to link here and it takes so long to link every product and honestly just with my health and everything like that and combined with my adhd i just I just cannot link everything. I am so sorry, you guys. But if there's anything here that you want the link for, I will reply to you. Just comment down below. Hit me up in the comments. I will get the link for you guys. Uh, but yeah, I have a huge, huge glitter haul coming up. And I thought, you know what? Why not just throw some of it into this haul? Because, I mean, these are great colors for Valentine's Day. So this one is a repurchase. Some of you may remember from my older videos. Uh, my bag that I got before has like this much left. I use this glitter so often, you guys. It is a holographic pink. And oh, again, we have a uh, stray randomness in there. Not sure what that is. But as you guys can see, it does come with two different sizes. It comes with the small hexi glitter and the larger hexi glitter. Super, super cute. And I got this and this is actually also a repurchase and I don't even think I ever showed you guys the original bag of this that I got but I use this for so many different projects and so many different things in my shop and these are hearts so these are super cute and look how holographic they are you guys so so pretty love those then I got this glitter and I actually like to use this glitter for snow um I actually have like three different whites I just I wanted to get this video done and stop procrastinating and it would have taken me too long to dig through all the glitter to find the other whites. Uh, but yeah, you guys, I will show them to you in the glitter haul video. Uh, but yeah, this is glitter that I like to use for snow, but I think it could also be really pretty for Valentine's Day. It is like a matte glitter, but it is also extremely sparkly. So I love that. And, um, if I give you guys the link, like there's like 50 different glitters on the link, but how you can tell is that this says 165 
dash one so that is the glitter that's how you'll know which white glitter you're getting because whereas this one is like just white some of the other ones are like whites that shine blue or whites that shine purple or you know just have a bit of a different shine to them or aren't matte stuff like that uh so then we have this red glitter and i actually have the red in two different shades of red this is 22 so again if you're looking for this glitter uh, this one is 22 uh, there's another one that's not as deep of a red that's more of like a uh, YouTube logo red uh, and I did get them both so in the glitter haul video I will show you guys the difference uh, but yeah super super pretty and again this is a repurchase I have bought this before and I've almost used the entire bag uh, and then this one is actually not a repurchase so this one is the only one of the glitters that is not a repurchase. Now I have bought this glitter before in a different shade of pink and in blue and I love them so much you guys and I barely have any of them left and I just love this glitter so much and then this time I realized when I went to repurchase the pink and the blue that oh my goodness there's actually more than one shade of pink so I bought them both and this one's like more of a purpley pink. This glitter is like translucent iridescent it is just the prettiest thing ever it is so iridescent that it's practically holographic like it is just absolutely gorgeous and i almost feel like this one has three different sizes in fact i i'm pretty sure it does it's got like ultra fine glitter in it and then it's also got like the small glitters like that size and then it's also got the larger glitters so super super pretty guys absolutely love that now we are getting towards the end here guys but there is still a few more items so these are super super cute i am absolutely obsessed with these you guys these are some pastel hearts with wings and of course these are not just good for valentine's day these are good for so many projects magical girls like any enchanted anything they are so freaking kawaii i love them so much you guys and honestly i had these in my cart for ages like i had them in my cart for like a month before i finally bought them but again they are a newer item like i had never seen these before the end of 2022 that's when these came out so a good idea when you're shopping on aliexpress when you go to a seller's shop is to click on the new items tab and that's where you'll be able to find the newer items and you can definitely tell if it's a new item if nobody has hearted the item before or if only a few people have hearted it that doesn't necessarily mean that nobody else likes it that just means it's a new item so yeah i got these and these are also available in matte like you see how these ones are like shiny resin and again the wings have are like translucent with the opaque resin at the back they are also available in just pure opaque resin uh, but I did think that these ones were a little bit cuter, so I got these ones. Next up, we have some charms, and it looks like one fell out of the bag. Honestly, with these, I really wish that I hadn't got mixed. I don't know if mixed was the only option, but, like, for some reason, the blue, I didn't end up with any blue ones. Um, I, I'm really, I really don't really like this shade of green. It's like avocado green. I'm really not into it, but I mean, I'm sure I can use it for something, maybe like some type of kawaii, uh, even like a Halloween thing. I know you're like heart macaron for Halloween, but you know, pastelloween, whatever. I don't know. This is just not my color, but I'm sure I'll find some type of use for it. Uh, and this one not my favorite again but i mean chocolate so anyway these are little heart shaped macarons and unlike the other ones these ones are not flat back uh these are available with or without a hook but not from the same seller i got them from but i have seen them without the hook from other sellers so yeah this is probably the only purchase out of everything that i'm not in love with if i bought these again i would probably ask for just the pink the purple and the baby blue i think then i would have been a lot happier with them uh but anyway yeah i did end up with those uh i also got these teddy bears and these are done in like the old style of charm or cabochon they are flat back and like you can just tell by the look of them 
uh, like this is more how cabochon charms used to look like 10 years ago, five, six years ago, rather than like the new ones, like have like really different looks to them. Um, and I don't know if I had never seen these before, or these might be an old item and just, I was never interested in them before. Uh, but I thought these would be perfect. As soon as I saw them, I knew that I could do a whole bunch of things for items for my shop with these. So I picked these up. And once again, you can get them in just the mint, uh, in the white, in the pink, or you can get the mix pack. And I chose the mix pack. Uh, these mint ones with the pink heart are definitely my favorite. If I bought them again, I would probably get just the pink and mint because they are so adorable. But I did get those. Uh, I also got this pack of sprinkles, clay sprinkles for Valentine's Day. And the cute thing about these sprinkles is that like it has a mix of the sprinkles, the clay hearts, and then you've also got the little envelopes. Like, aren't those so cute for Valentine's Day? So these are kind of like a mini version of the other envelopes over here, only they're just the white ones. And I'm pretty sure that those white envelopes are also available in 10 mm so if you're ever looking for like female slices on aliexpress 10 mm is the large size and then 5 mm would be the smaller size like that and it's really cool because in the last couple years they've even come out with like 10 mm hearts and like all sorts of stuff in 10 mm usually 10 mm is my favorite uh but of course you know it is good to mix them with some 5 mm so anyway i just thought this was such an adorable mix for valentine's day so i had to pick that up and then last but not least you guys we have some more little hearts for Valentine's Day. And once again, these are reminiscent of conversation hearts, uh, but they are a little bit different. They're almost like, they remind me of like a chocolate heart box that like you give someone on Valentine's Day, like you're like the like iconic or I don't know, sorry, my brain's not working, but they remind me of like, you know, if you see like on a movie, like an old movie, like a boyfriend giving his girlfriend uh chocolates for valentine's day it's like the box would look like this so i just thought those were super cute and again i could have messaged the seller and said that i didn't want certain colors but i mean even these chocolate ones i could definitely use for projects for my shop so i just ended up getting them as is and the pastel colors are so freaking cute you guys like i i just love these shades of pastel they are so so super pastel and super pretty definitely had to pick those up okay you guys so that is it for this haul i have no idea why this video took so long i literally thought this was going to be a 10 to 15 minute video but somehow i ended up with over 40 minutes of footage what the heck? I don't know. I guess that's just me. Anyway, you guys, it's so nice to be back. Uh, I apologize for the lighting. Like I said before, I will definitely make it better in the next video like I used to have it. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up because it really helps the channel. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye for now, Miss Eddie. Blue.